A banking company that can trace its roots in downtown Green Bay back 139 years once again has its headquarters in downtown Green Bay. After being in Ashwaubenon on the past 15 years, Associated Bank Corp headquarters now on Main Street in the former Regency 333 building. Fox 11's Ben Krumholtz was there for today's celebration. What was a mostly empty building in downtown Green Bay is now the new home for about 500 Associated Bank Corp employees. One of the happiest might be Lisa Kaiser. I originally was downtown before we moved out to Ashwaubenon and coming back is like coming home. Associated closed on the property last fall. On Monday, the company celebrated the $20 million move. We essentially gutted the inside of the building. We didn't do much to the outside other than put a new roof on. But if you go upstairs and take a tour, you'll see that we took a, a building that's you know almost 30 years old and made it feel very contemporary and light and modern and open. It's not a, a, a brand new shiny building. You know, we would have liked to have seen that, but more importantly, we want the jobs down here, good paying jobs. The new building is bringing employees together from six locations. All of the microwaves were placed on the first floor as one way of hopefully everyone getting to know each other. There's an economic benefit to being in one place, but there's also all those intangible benefits of having everybody working together and seeing each other all day. From the color of the carpet to the names of conference rooms, employees had a say in the process. So all of that really was around the themes of fun, engaging, inviting, and really what is it our vision to be at Associated. City leaders hope the move is just the start of companies choosing to relocate downtown. Uh, you got employees that are going to give back to the community. Uh, this, is a, this is a big step for downtown. It's a great experience and downtown has improved so much over the years that uh, it's, it's great to be back. Back to where it all began in 1874. In Green Bay, Ben Crumholz, Fox 11 News.